I know you felt that, you know? I feel like that's, you, it's in, that's in, the, the, the answer's in there. I act nice, but I'm bad as the rest of them. Except that one night that we found love at the festival. You know, stay tuned type shit. Hey, what's up? It's Tetris with Billboard News, hanging out with Jane Smith. How's it going, man? It's going really good, bro. I'm appreciating the vibes that you got going on there. Playing the music, setting the tone. What's going on today? You know, it's just a normal day in Sunset City, man. <laughs> Not a normal day for me, man. I, I like the vibes. Roses, left the match to talk, so I was hoping. So talk to me about why, after three years, a break from music, you decided now was the time to make a return. Just because I was sad, honestly. And I, I wanted to share that. I mean, I think that's a great thing as an artist that you were able to, you know, notice that you had some emotions that you wanted to get out. So is it more difficult to kind of process your emotions through music or is it easier for you that way? I think it's easier. I think it's a lot easier. You know what I mean? Like, just to say something through music, I think it's a lot easier. Um, than to just straight up saying it, you know? I can definitely understand, but you obviously have a lot of spotlight on you with you and your family. Is it hard for you to be kind of so honest and personal in a song like Roses when you're so used to having the spotlight? That's really the best answer that I could come up with for that particular question. No, I feel you, man. And I mean, honestly, the vibe that you're creating, even there in person and the vibe that you created, with the music video, the visualizer that you guys put out. It's it's a mood, man. So tell me how was it to create the visualizer and why you felt like that match Rosie? You know, I love the movies so much. You know, I go to the movies by myself a lot. Um, and that's a, a spiritual place for me to be at, to, uh, I don't know, be by myself and kind of reflect on my life. So Indeed. that's why I made that visualizer. So I did a lot of that this year, going to the movies by myself. Just tell me what it takes and I'm all yours. And all your pain is on I feel like with Roses, obviously, like I said, a personal song for you. Do you feel like that's the direction you're going in with maybe a full project or an album? Um, no. No. That's not the direction that I'm going in for the project. That's just, you know, I haven't really been able to um express myself when it comes to singles i feel like you know and i haven't really been able to like make singles that i really really love and that's really what i want to do with roses you know like icon wasn't a single you know 90 wasn't a single summertime in paris wasn't a single i'm really a guy that will go away and make an album and like just put it all out but i really want to give people a taste of just like what i'm on just on like a random day type of thing, you know what I mean? And obviously people feel like they already may have made their opinions about you. What do you want them to learn from your music this time around? Um, nothing really. I just want them to listen to the songs if they want to, you know? It's really only for the people that want to listen to it. It's not for everybody else. Oh, it's yeah. for the sad kids, you know what I mean? Like kids out there sad and stuff like it's for them and do you feel like you have a good community around you of fans that tune in to what you're what you're saying yeah i have the best fans in the freaking world they tell me sad stories about themselves they comment stuff on youtube you know i love them like i love my fans like for real i had willow in the studio the other day we were talking about her new project and she said that maybe you guys might work again so how's it working with your sister and do you think you might get her in the studio we're always in the studio I got more songs with Willow than anybody else on the planet. You know, me and Willow, we're locked in always forever. And yeah, yeah, you know, stay tuned type shit. Hell yeah, we'll be looking forward to it. And of course, you know, you took a three year break from music and now you're making a comeback. Your dad just made a comeback in the movies. Will we see you on the big screen again is my question. 
you know i know you felt that you know i feel like that's you, it's in that's in the, the, the answers in there dude Jaden, i really appreciate you sharing your art with us we're super excited about roses if you need anything from us at, here at billboard we'll always have your back man thank you so much for calling you guys are the best man